This is Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. On News Talk 93 FM. It's a fix. She's your queen to be a vision of perfection, an object of affection to quench your royal fire. Completely free from infection, your queen to be. Yes, people, that's how we welcome queens here at Nightly Fix. Welcome back. It's your boy Nara here. Ari, DJ Burns. I, I do nobody as matters right now but our guest. <laughs> Q, you don't matter. You don't matter, Jimmy Q. Our guest. <laughs> Special, beautiful guest in our midst right now. She's so royal. She's so beautiful. You said that so much time. How many times are you going to say it now? I get her name. <laughs> Charlene. Radley, that's yes. uh, did I say, did I say it right? You said it right. Did I? You did. Okay, yes. cool, cool. Because yeah. we saw some accents, I was like, is yeah. it? Wait, well, it's Radline. Radline. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I, you can say Radline as well. But you, you, it's Rad, it's Radline. Radline, yes. okay. <laughs> yes, if you go to Germany, it's Radline. Yeah, because I know that's how, mm -hmm. you're German. Like, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My background is German. Oh, okay. Yes. <laughs> so, that's how we introduce, why, why, why you choose that one, narrow that song? Because she's an object of affection. <laughs> okay. And perfection. Simple. Simple That's it. That, yeah. <laughs> All right, man. Anyways, we're here with the newly crowned Mr. Jamaica Universe, Charlene. Um, you're taking over and filling some big shoes there. Oh, well, gosh. You ready? So, case the shoes, <laughs> smaller, <laughs> not too but, Yeah, but you have some I big shoes. we're the same available. size, so I think we're good. <laughs> yes. Uh, <laughs> you feel any pressure seeing that? Even though she wasn't Miss Universe, but she the might as well universe. be doing it. Yeah, she's yeah. people's mm -hmm. champ. So no, you feel any pressure? Feel not really, because I'm just going to be myself. And mm. as long as I'm myself, then I would hope that everyone loves me for me. You know, because Casey had her reign. She did an exceptional job. And I'm just going to do what I, you know, bring my personality to it and hope that they fall in love with me just as much. Well, I'm here falling in love with you. <laughs> oh. Um, so I'm joking, I um, <laughs> <laughs> well, what, what are you doing since doing it though? Oh, 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 yeah, leave it up and enjoy the crowns of our home. Oh, yeah, wow. what are the perks yeah. of being Miss Universe, the Jamaica? The perks of them? I mean, you get your picture taken. That's always nice. That's you know? Nice. Well, you're a mother, so. <laughs> sure. I think I go like that's of you. Well, yeah. come, on, come on. No, but it's so different when you, like people come up to you and they're like, can I take a picture with you? Or uh, can I have your autograph? It oh. was so crazy. I was like, okay, here you go. You know, I wasn't used to that, yeah. definitely. But, you know, just being able to kind of make an impact on a grand scale mm. is just I think the biggest like thing that this competition brings for the Miss Universe Jamaica you know um, I want to ask personally like okay. how important is pre-judging for competitions like this like is it is it what we see is it that we should Jamaican should probably just ex expect say alright what the question and answer on the night mm -hmm. is what determines the winner or mm -hmm. is stuff behind the scene and everything that happens throughout the competition that you know it, putting the factor of right. getting the Miss Universe. The pre-judging is probably the most intense part of the whole entire competition. And that's what I think people don't... I wish people could see that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because you, you're one-on-one -on -one with the judges and you're able to kind of talk to them and they get to really know you. Yeah. You know, that's the unfortunate part, I think, about the whole entire thing that the people just see us on that last night and then that's it. And they think there's so much more to it, yeah. you know, and they don't get to see our real personality in the whole entire thing. Because yeah. on stage, I'm like, I'm very poised and everything, but like, I'm really goofy and just kind of, you know, I'm all of us. So, yeah. you know, it's just one <laughs> of those. just hit my chair just now. <laughs> <laughs> Prove the point. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but it's really, really important to in prejudging. Mm -hmm. Like you're kind of freaking out. You're like, what yeah. are you going to ask me? You know, I hope this, but you just kind of be yourself. And mm -hmm. once you get into the room, it's like all the nerves just kind of go away. Is it is it one day or like one hour? Or like it's one day, one and day. you have a set of minutes with each judge, mm -hmm. and you just kind of talk to them. They ask you different 
questions and stuff like that and you just kind of go around and you answer them and they mm -hmm. get a feel for you it's like speed dating <laughs> yeah kind of thing you know you have like three minutes with each person and you kind of see if you have a connection yeah you know? <laughs> that's putting it in perspective yeah yeah, yeah. 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 kind of like speed, speed dating, dating. Yes. wow so because yeah. many because everybody you know like there's always an issue mm -hmm. but i feel like people don't really realize that when you go on that stage it's really blinding like to see all that light and then everyone looking at you mm -hmm. like and people's like well no that one should win or that one should win you know so I'm, that's mm -hmm. why i ask you that question like how important is prejudging in all of the process to get the miss universe like you know they go very hand in hand mm -hmm. as well because you know you want to make sure that even if you did great in pe prejudging yeah that you don't go up go on the stage and you just kind of throw it away as yeah. well you really have to full through go full through with the whole entire thing you have mm -hmm. to make sure of that but prejudging is more important i would say but yeah. thus being on stage is just as important as okay. well yeah yeah you know but it is nerve-wracking because yeah. you have the lights on you and you know it's you're blinding just, yeah, yeah you know you know what you want to say but then you know <laughs> yeah exactly yeah. and sometimes you're like your thoughts escape you yeah. and you're just kind of like oh lord what did i just say <laughs> you know yeah so it's really nerve-wracking a little bit but yeah. i mean i was shaking on yeah. stage definitely i was like oh my gosh you know like i can't believe this but <laughs> I was. I wanted to. Well, Orin wanted to say it to your face. But like when we were watching the competition together, mm -hmm. and when he came out in the dress, he's like, "Oh, she's gonna go. we're gonna walk it together. Because that's what to do in our spare time." Oh. <laughs> yeah, but as, as I saw you, I'm like, "She are going." Oh, yes. wow. Yeah. Well, thank you. So like, thank you. Who the dresses? Like, who choose? Like, you choose them, and then just say, "All right, this is all the dress." Mm -hmm. This one is for you, or you you have they a kind of Izuri kind of gets a sense of your personality, mm -hmm. and then they kind of like put something together for you. Mm -hmm. You know, like I was like I'm, you know, I'm kind of sassy a little bit, but I'm playful and that kind of things. And I feel like that dress really just executed of who I am, yeah. kind of thing. So they kind of get a flavor of who you are, and then they put together a dress. And then when you see it, you're just kind of like, that's it. That makes sense, you yeah. know. So it's kind of a team effort. You get to keep the dress. No, unfortunately. <laughs> I was wondering, like, you know, that dress is so bomb. Like, you, do you get to keep it? Like, is that one of the I perks? I was walking around, like, you know, I was like, I'm feeling myself. Like, yeah. you know, just walking around in the dress. But, I mean, the dress is heavy as well. Mm. So, well, you make it one of floats. Like, especially the one girl, like, the, um, the, I don't remember her name, but the ball girl. I can't remember Denisha. her name. Yes. Mm -hmm. She glided. And I was like, mm, girl, look yes. at you. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't ever know said the dress right, heavy. Yeah. Right. But right. then once it's such on, um, well, as I said, I stalked the Instagram page tonight. <laughs> Usually I'm the person who is stalking me. Right. Yeah. Because like, I didn't even know that you were, you were in such a serious accident because mm -hmm. your face. Oh. <laughs> don't tell not on a story right. like can you talk us through that like sure yeah, yeah I mean I mean it, you're gonna tell the story like I'll hold you for a time no though. that's fine <laughs> that's fine that's fine cause I actually have a scar yeah. underneath around my eye mm -hmm. but I kinda cover it up with makeup a little bit so okay. you can't really see it but mm -hmm. one day I'll come out with no makeup on my mm -hmm. face and you'll see it because sometimes people just say punch your eye you get punched in the face you know how many times I get asked that really but, yes <laughs> my gosh okay but it happened seven years ago mm -hmm. and I was actually crossing the street with my friends we went to a movie mm -hmm. and we were early it, which we, movie was it you know I mean I remember Jim maybe Master. oh my gosh <laughs> that, I hope it was worth it probably yeah. should I remember that you know mm. yeah cause it's like cause Iron Man or something Iron Man it was, something. It was worth it it was worth it <laughs> yes absolutely cause it sold out within like 20 minutes of us being in line uh, yeah yeah. cause so, you said you were early we were, like, well we were early you know <laughs> yeah <laughs> early mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and we we were there and it sold out while we were in line so the next time wasn't until like an hour later mm -hmm. and so we're like all right let's just go to that one so we got the tickets and we had an hour to kind of like you know fool around yeah. do something else and there's a cosmetic store across the street mm -hmm. so in order to get there it's a it's a major intersection that you have to actually cross yeah. and uh we crossed the four it was first the four lanes we mm -hmm. crossed together and then i just the last thing i remember seeing was looking and seeing that it was a red light and that was it yeah i woke up in an ambulance my friends say 20 minutes later and mm -hmm. i just i woke up and i thought i was in my bedroom mm -hmm. actually yeah i thought i was in my, i thought i saw the movie and everything and i woke up and i tried to move my arms and when i looked down i was strapped in yeah. and i had blood covered all over my arms i had a neck brace on mm -hmm. and i was like what just happened like mm -hmm. i could not understand what was i couldn't it couldn't register to me because yeah. the last thing i remember was i was with my friends yeah and the paramedic came over to me and she was like, 
don't worry, don't move, everything's going to be okay. And I was like, what happened to me? Like, mm. what happened? And she was like, you got hit by a car. And I looked at her like, when did that happen? Because, Stop lying. You know, like, yeah. yeah, I was like, when did that happen? And yeah. she was just like, don't worry, you know, just stay still. My mother ended up coming to the ambulance. And I remember looking at my mother and holding her hand and just saying, I don't want to die. Yeah. Don't let me die. Wow. And she was just like, I mean, she was in tears and she just said, don't worry, Must my girl. Must be heartbreaking. You yeah. know, yeah. And I'm like, you know, she was just like, don't worry, my girl, like, be strong. Mm-hmm. You're not going to die. You're going to live. Just, yeah. you know, stay positive. And I remember I was really tired after I got hit by the car. Obviously, I was losing blood, <laughs> you know? Yeah. You know? <laughs> you lose really like that, you know? And I was like, I really want to go to bed. And the paramedic was like, you have to stay asleep. I mean, you have well, to stay awake. Yeah. Yeah. I just, yeah, don't, 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 don't she was like, she said, she was like, you know, I was like, okay, well then, if I have to stay awake, I'm just gonna crack jokes the whole entire time until I get to the airport. Really? And she, I was like, all right, where are we going? And she was like, you're being helicoptered to the trauma center. And I was like, all right, we're going on a helicopter, mom. Let's do this. You know, first time in a helicopter. Let's go. I don't and believe you. I swear, you can ask my mother. She was looking at me like, what is wrong with my child? No, you know, I'm you kind know? of believer because she kind of dear devil. <laughs> She looked like <laughs> really, really? Yes. Yes. Wow. yes, and I remember just getting into you know, I remember I don't really remember being helicoptered, yeah. but I remember going through you know, when you watch like ER shows or something, yeah. and you see the flashing lights, yeah, it was like that, yeah. And I received, I ended up getting um 15 stitches on my head, mm-hmm. I have a gash on my head, mm-hmm. and just scars on my arm. You can kind of yeah. see my skin right here, yeah, and all over my shoulder and around my eye. There was a huge gash around my eye, yeah. and they dubbed me the miracle child of the night Mm -hmm. because i received no broken bones nothing internally no internal bleeding nothing and it was such a severe impact yes and she was going 45 miles an hour and that's like they were like how are you alive yeah you know and the whole long is you you spent eight hours eight hours hours i was released i was released eight hours after being admitted into the hospital so what was the recovery like like you know like was it were you told to be on bed rest and or yeah, yeah I was told to just kind of take a couple days staying in bed and that kind of thing and I just needed time to heal that was the thing they were just mm. like kind of take time to heal I used coconut oil vitamin E oil because everything just needed to just heal external mm-hmm. you know yeah. so I just needed time that was the thing they were just like she just needs time and it was very very hard for me because yeah. Growing up, I'd always wanted to be a model, and that was always a dream of mine. Yeah. And I remember walking into the room, into my, into the bathroom when I got home, went to the mirror, and I just started to cry. Yeah. And I was like, I will never be able to model. Like my dreams are shattered. Mm. And I didn't take no for an answer. Two years later, I just started to just kind of play around with makeup yeah. and stuff like that. And I started to look at magazines and ask models that like friends who were models. Mm-hmm. And I was like, okay, how do you do this? What do you have to do? You mm-hmm. know, because no one's perfect. And yeah. What do you have to do? And and I'm just like, ask like a big, big question. I'm just thinking about it. I mean, like <laughs> you talk about the outward scars and. Mm-hmm. the time it took for that tea but how long did it take for the psychological scars to heal <laughs> for you to say I'm going to do this and Bruh. enter <laughs> this universe to make a universe well, contest was, I, yeah. well my next question is like did you always want to, to enter Miss Universe or it just happened like somebody said well oh you should enter this year or well I knew that I wanted to to I'm a very outspoken outspoken individual mm-hmm. and I, I'm a very I'm opinionated and I believe a lot of things yeah. and modeling is great but you're not able to kind of like if you believe in something you're not really like yeah you're just supposed to be a pretty face and take picture yeah exactly and I'm just like I want to be more than just a pretty face Mm -hmm. I want to actually stand for something so when people see me they're like oh she does this she's not just a pretty face yeah and I knew that entering Miss Jamaica Universe I would be able to build that platform and be able to stand on a pedestal and stand for something more than just beauty yeah and once I I was like you know I went back and forth for a while I was like should I do this I don't know maybe you know and everything especially with everything that Casey has built I was like okay how in the world you know would I follow that yeah Yeah. you know but I was like no I believe in myself I've gotten to where I am Mm -hmm. because of just being who I am yeah so what's the thing you're a fighter too you're strong so yeah so you know why can't I do this and my mom just support me and my father my whole family is just like girl what are you worrying about just go for it just go and here I am today so what is it that you stand for well I definitely want to be an advocate for people in um in accidents for yeah. roadsides because it's gone up 
and you know <laughs> make makes sense <laughs> makes sense yeah. when you look at the numbers it's gone up 20% mm-hmm. from last year yeah. and it's the highest number in fatalities on the road yeah. since I think like 2005 mm-hmm. you know and that to me just spoke like I was like, wow, that's mm. something that people need to address and yeah. educate and stuff like that. And it's just something that's so simple, whether it's just looking, you know, looking at the road and using, cause I, you know, you, using the, um, the crosswalk yeah. mm. or like buckling your seat. Preach. Belt, you know, <laughs> like, like even the body system. You know, body system yes, crossing the body system. Crossing yes. And holding hands. Yes. No, but I think that you need to address, like, people need to know. Look left. Look, look right. right. Yeah. Look left again right. before you cross the road. Because you see something like the that, right they just walk just away. Okay, you don't really know directions. I don't know directions. <laughs> <laughs> but it's true, but people don't really get that. Like, even mm. when them just think, so, you know what? Car must stop. Right. Let me just walk. And Car it's must not the stop. Case. Yes. It's not the case at yeah. all. And that's the thing. And people think it's so silly. They're like, look left, look right. And they're like, what you? You know? <laughs> yeah. But it's the truth. Yeah. Because it, it's something that's so simple that if you do look left, you're like, oh, Gosh, yeah, almost, you know, you never know. Yeah, so I think that's implementing that. I definitely mm-hmm. want to get into. Yeah, that. so you're definitely looking to do work with the National Road Safety Council. Absolutely, mm-hmm. yes. All right. Um. Well, you know, with with these pageants every year, there always some talk in the <laughs> national. <laughs> You know, they're collective. never happy. Yeah, you know, they always the talk of skin tone and mm-hmm. authenticity. You ever think about that? And them thing never get to you. Cause even the last name, people see somebody say, oh, she's she German. I right? last name German. Oh, my name Art. That, that's Scottish. Like, people, come on. Uh-huh. So, right. you ever think about them thing that them no. thing ever get to you? No, not at all. Because it's out of many one people. Mm. And it's like, we're all. People need to be reminded of yes, that. Exactly. Yeah. You know? And they just need to like understand that we're not just, if you were to look at Jamaica, like, how would you describe a Jamaican? Yes. Uh, looks wise. Black and you, tough. You can't. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Mine says black and tough. Yeah, but said mine never catch that. <laughs> you know? Yeah. It's like in my family, I have Chinese Jamaican, I have fair, I have dark skin. It's like we're just out of many one people, literally. Yeah. So I think we just stick to our motto. It, it's nothing that you, I'm not focusing on it yeah definitely and as i said that's why i asked you how important is prejudging because mm-hmm. you know like even though we might think that oh the other darker skin one yeah but then there's a lot of things that happen behind the scenes mm-hmm. so i mean probably i would guess people should do show more behind the scenes i don't right. know i really wish they would <laughs> yeah maybe next maybe when next year behind the scenes, behind the scenes <laughs> They just want to see the girls in the bathing suits. Yeah. <laughs> in the bathing suits, no. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> but I want to also touch on that you are a model for Target because I think, would I look at my cable TV? Would I be seeing you? <laughs> yeah, I've done a couple of different jobs, you yeah. know, through, I've definitely, I've done Target twice. I was on their weekly ad mm-hmm. and that was amazing. Mm-hmm. Pretty cool, you know, but I've also done Project Runway All-Stars. Yeah. I've done new, um, the Real Housewives of New York. Talk, I did their fashion, talk. you know. Like, She's a model, a so, real model, not an Instagram model. <laughs> Yes. Oh my god. No offense, you know? Instagram. Man. No offense. <laughs> you yeah. know, like I have two billboards in New York in wow. Times Square, you know. That's a big deal. Yeah, I know. You know how surreal Times that was? Square, yeah. Yes, I walked Shout into out Times Chris Square. Martin. So <laughs> big deal. Yeah. Big deal. Yeah. You know, but yeah, I walked into Times Square and there was my face and I was just like, No way. You know, <laughs> this is crazy. So yeah. what what? campaign what was it it was for Star- vanilla star jeans mm-hmm. it's like a forever 21 type of mm-hmm. you know clothing and it was on the side of the parsons building i don't and know what that well, place sorry you know, but it's all right it <laughs> was <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> i only know times girl yeah yeah. It's, it's right there. yeah so local. so yeah so i did that and i was just like mm-hmm. and they they reused me they used me once mm-hmm. and then they shot me again and they were like don't worry surprise soon mm-hmm. and then i walked out and it, there it was again so being a model won't interfere with you do is as Miss Jamaica Universe. No, like, mm-hmm. absolutely not. No, I'm here and I'm here full time mm-hmm. and, you know, it goes hand in hand. I'm mm-hmm. a model but, you know, this is something that I definitely want to pursue. Yeah. So, definitely wouldn't affect it. So, you can still do jobs like if people call you, like if Target say, Charlene, <laughs> come. We need right, you to come shoot, right. do some shoes and do all you can shoes. do it. I mean, it all depends on my schedule and yeah. whatever availability I have, mm-hmm. then we'll just work through it. Okay, mm-hmm. that's cool. Alright, so the question on people's mind now. Oh boy. Can you take the big crown? <laughs> come whenever, when, November? This is December. December. I don't December, even maybe, know. Yeah. yeah, so you think you can actually Absolutely. take that crown? Yes. Confidence is key. Yes. Confidence Indeed. is key. Mm-hmm. If I've gotten where I am mm. through everything, why can't I take that crown? Yeah. 
That's where I live. And I mean, in case the Canada's open it, you know, that like people kind of say, all right, the next Jamaican coming is going to get right, a crown automatically. Right. Yeah, get, yeah true, <laughs> And if you're not winning, you're going you go insane. Really. Yeah. <laughs> true that. <laughs> I'll take that. I'll take that compliment. Yes. <laughs> all right, we wish you all the best. Yes. Thank you. Where is it, Kibu? Don't want knows. No one Me, knows. Me, that's it. China. Yeah. yeah. Secrets. Yeah. Well, well, secrets. Whenever it happens, whenever it's announced, you know that oh, Jamaica yes. will be watching. Yes. 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 You don't know. You have our full support. You have my Thank full support. You. And all these things. You're 24, right? I'm 25 now. 25. My birthday was just the other day, August 10th. Really? Oh. Yes. You know who else is 25? Who's that? Me. Really? Yeah. When was your birthday? Yeah, October. Oh, in a comment. <laughs> this this okay. person. Oh, no, stop. We didn't even have enough time to carry out the flirting when we did start. But yeah. <laughs> and next time, next time yeah. that you come, make, when you win, just All make right. sure to come to this. Absolutely. Place. Absolutely. Yes, I got we'll confirm you. you. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. Why are we playing camera, though? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> gonna use that against me like yes. she said. We my will. Queen. We will. My queen, <laughs> thank you for gracing us with your presence. Thank you. Thank you for having me. You know, uh, it's a bit shant. It's a shanty room. You know, <laughs> didn't have to pass through, but you did. <laughs> a lot of peasants around. Uh, <laughs> don't pay them no mind. All right? <laughs> we are called peasants now, uh, real and uh, truly. <laughs> but yeah, we wish you all the best and. I have no doubt say I go represent to the fullest. Thank you. Thank you so right. much. Uh, Charlene, Radlene. Why you say my last name like that? Radlene. Rad- well, why am I just say let me say it different <laughs> from, from the first the time say, yeah? You butchered the name. Charlene. Radlene. Just Radlene. 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 Just like that. Yes. Yeah. There you go. Highly fix. <laughs> Well, you know, it's Dam Dam, also known as Random Guy. You don't know, representing for the 90 fix, addictive to entertaining video. I'm going to tell you this right about now. I just want to know subscribe to us on YouTube. Don't forget that someday. People also like us on Facebook. Alright, because you know Facebook. Follow us on Twitter, because we're out no beta. Talk with Spitter. And also, don't forget the Instagram. You got to follow us on Instagram, because you know the Instagram is where the thing. Go on See? So, I'm soon, I'm on it.